Hey guys, my name is Angelia and welcome back to my channel and welcome to a very exciting collaboration. So today we are doing the Pride Simmers Create a Sim collab. Um, it's gonna be with a bunch of other simmers. All the links will be down in the description below. So please be sure to go check out their videos and their channels and subscribe to them. They are amazing and it's just so much fun to be a part of an amazing group of creators for a really great cause for Pride Month. Um, so we're coming together to celebrate and to sort of bring awareness, I guess. Um, and yeah, so we all decided to make our own sims. Um, I decided to make this lovely lady that you guys are seeing right here. I had some trouble finding hair for her. Like, I went through so many hairs trying to find the perfect one and... The one I really wanted to use didn't come in the color I wanted and I couldn't find the recolors of it in short enough time, so... I had a pick a completely different hair, but um, uh, I just, I wanted her to be a really cute redhead and it just didn't happen. Um, but she is a lesbian character and I think she's gorgeous. I'm kind of in love with her. You will probably see her in an LP eventually because I love her that much. Like she came out perfect. Um, I tried to dress her in really bright and friendly colors and all of that. But um, yeah, so there is like a Q and A portion to this collaboration. We got a bunch of questions to answer. Well, like five of them. Um, so I'm gonna go ahead and get to that portion of it while you guys watch me create this lovely sim. Uh, the first question is, how do you identify sexuality and gender? I am a female and heterosexual. Um, I guess that about covers it. I'm basic. I'm, yeah, and all of that fun, happy, stereotypical crap. Um, what is your favorite color of the rainbow? Uh, I'm gonna go with violet. It's purple and lavender is my favorite color, so... They're in the same family, um, and violet is a color of the rainbow. Um, I would say yellow is probably a close second. I really love the color yellow. Um, I don't know what it is, I just... I love yellow. It's, it's a beautiful color. Um, the third question is, what does Pride Month mean to you? This is a big one. Um, I feel like I'm gonna babble on a little bit, so bear with me here. Pride Month is so incredibly important, especially right now in the current state of everything that's going on in this world. Um, Everyone deserves to be treated as an equal, and obviously it doesn't always happen, um, which is incredibly unfortunate, but it shouldn't matter who you love or what gender you are, you should be treated just as a normal human being, because you are a normal human being, you just, you can't really choose who you love, you fall in love with who you love. Um, it should really only matter who you are as a person, not, not as a gender, not as a sexuality. It should just matter if you're a good person in your heart. That's what's most important, I feel like. Um, and a lot of people still don't seem to get that, which is crazy to me. Um, but I think it's important to be yourself and be proud of who you are. And I know it's scary, especially in the time that we're living in right now, where things are so, I guess, uncertain, especially in the country that I live in. Um, but. We won't get into any of that part of it, um, but don't let anyone tell you that you can't be who you truly are. Don't let anyone tell you that. Hold on to who you are. Don't let them take that away from you, and I think that's incredibly important during this time. Um, the fourth question is, what is something that you are proud of? Um, it's kind of a cheesy answer, but um, I am proud of what I have accomplished in just one year of starting YouTube, and it's been more of like... A year and a few months now, um, but I never thought that any of this could become a reality, and now there's also Twitch on top of it, which is crazy. Um, but more than that, I'm proud of how far I've come in the past few years. I was in a really dark place a couple of years back, um, you know, with the whole being dumped slash abandoned type thing. Um, I was, yeah, I was in a pretty, pretty, pretty dark place there, um, but I managed to pull myself out of it for the most part. Um, you know, there are still those days where things get bad, but, um, and I'm still dealing with the after effects of all of that, but it's an ongoing process that you kind of have to just take one day at a time, and I think it's okay to be proud of those little accomplishments, even if they are small ones, because eventually those are going to add up and become big accomplishments. So yeah. Um, last but not least, the final question is, who is someone or multiple people that have helped you in the process of self-discovery? Um, again, it's gonna sound corny and cliche, but definitely my family and my mom mostly in particular there. Um, she always let me know that it's okay to be myself. 
um, whoever that might be, she would tell me, you know, you could want to be an Alaskan dog sledder and I would still support you <laughs> and all that. So yeah, I was never really afraid or worried about what she might think of me and who I am as a person because she always let me know that no matter what, if I was a lesbian, if I was bisexual, if I was straight like I am, um, that's okay. She wouldn't care, she wouldn't love me any less because of that. Um, and I think that's an important thing that we need to instill in this generation and in future generations to come, that it's okay to be who you are. And I feel like a lot of times people are so afraid to be who they are because of judgment from other people and judgment from, I guess, authority figures. Um, again, not gonna go into detail on that one, but um, you know, just, it, it can be scary. But it is incredibly important that you embrace who you are. Um, so yeah, um, I guess that kind of brings into this. I'm going to stop yapping and let you guys watch the rest of this. I hope you guys have a magical day. Please be sure to check out the links to the other simmers down below who are part of this Pride Simmers collaboration. They are amazing and I am so honored and in awe to be a part of this with them. It's it's an honor. Thank you again so much. Um, but yeah, please be sure to check out those links. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you have a magical day and I will see you guys next time. Bye!